Okay, welcome to Dow Stock Talk, where I talk about topics relating to investing in finance, but more specifically, the stock market. In this video, I'll be giving an update on my SongVest experience or portfolio. If you're not really familiar with SongVest, is, SongVest allows you to collect money from music royalties, so it allows you to have ownership of royalties based off of what they call uh, song share. So you earn the rights proportional to the amount of money that you invested. Now I will say from my personal experience, a lot of times this is more so geared towards people who are fans of music versus an uh, investment itself. But if you're a big fan of music and you want to support the artist and be able to earn some money from royalties as far as the amount of downloads they streamed or amount of month times it was played or people downloaded song vest to me it was kind of like a one-of-a-kind thing for me personally i thought it was something interesting as far as music royalties as far as the payouts and stuff this is something completely new to me but I was able to try it out for SongVest. I think at that particular time, you could get a song share for like $15 or $16. And on this particular platform, I got the a song called Hit The Quan. I'll go over some other stuff that they have. Because now, I believe they changed it maybe to a lease where it would be like $100 a share or something like that. But I'll definitely show you um, what my experience was so far so the last time we recorded it they gave me one well not gave me but um there was one particular payment out and i believe that was for a dollar or something but as you can see the total amount of matter of fact we can click on my investment so this was the song um the song hit the quan i don't know and it just kind of you know shows for the last 12 months how much revenue is and this is how much that you would receive this is how much you would receive based off of the last 12 months royalty paid per unit last 12 months so just to kind of give you an idea so i did receive that dollar in 98 cents payment i believe now this is the you know the song that hit the quan thing if you want to hopefully youtube don't Turn the TV on, bro. Turn your TV on. This was the song. Um, What's on the TV, TV myself? Cause I'm feeling myself. Yes. Throw a flag on the plate. Wow. That's crazy. The whole gym is packed, man. The yeah. Whole this is in there, man. You putting us on the map. I'm about to speed this man, up, up but I'm on my way to get you right this now. I know, I just, and that's how I end up getting it. But, okay, so let's check my investments and let's get back to what, oh, click on dashboard to see, you know, what we, you guys really want to know. So, I have one share, $16. The purchase actually occurred, it looks like, 10-14-2021. So, it looked like I had it for close to about a year. Well, I'm missing off of this. Now, as you can see, let's look at hit the quan. So, oh, this is the the value of the song share, which would be sixteen dollars. The way they had it was, you know, a little weird, but this is the side we want to go to, and we can look at the last four quarters. Let's see the way. Let's see how they have this. Okay, it's kind of weird how they have it. So, for for year to date for twenty twenty two for quarter two. I received two dollars and seventy four cents and for quarter three I received one dollar and thirty cents so that's kind of, they have it I guess a little um, weird and I guess this is kind of a new feature so uh, well a new setup so this is kind of what they show me and the good news is the uh, I did see the amount this um, the dollar and thirty cents and the one before this, which was two dollars and seventy-four cents, I did see that they transferred it to my bank account. So overall, as far as the sixteen dollars total royalty received, four dollars um, from the previous royalty quarter received a dollar and thirty cents. It's also good to mention that I noticed 
the it declines substantially. It's also good to mention, okay, will this be continue on a decline or you know will I'm just trying to track and see how will these payments go on? Will they kind of get less and less and less? Will it you know just to see the when I can expect to you know be able to get that sixteen dollars back from royalty? It could you know take some time. But you never really know what these artists and these particular songs. So that's why for me, I get geared it more towards people who are like into music and they're actually fan of the artist. So they're not necessarily looking for the maximum return, but they like to support the artist and also make money from the songs that they, you know, listen to the songs that they like. Yeah, so this is, you know, my experience so far. I'll definitely keep you guys posted. I may end up getting another one just to kind of just get more exposure to it. But as you can see, the total amount invested is $16. Previous quarter royalty received $1.30 and total royalties received $4. So I'll definitely be tracking this as well. And I believe the company they're raising, uh, raising capital so if you wanted to invest early, I mean, I'm just kind of saying if right now they have just launched Songwriters is raising capital and now you can invest or something like that. I just wanted to kind of throw that out there as well. Let's look at some of the other stuff that they end up having. Um, let's look at some of the upcoming on sale now they I noticed as far as the, the variety and stuff they don't really have a large variety because right now on sale now they have they don't really have anything maybe after they raise some funds and stuff they can get like bigger names and more people on there so if we can see the upcoming sales let's see if I recognize any of these artists um I do recognize little baby little baby implies I recognize that so let's click on that just to see um so yeah they just this is kind of like they first come up with like a bed and then they have a smaller sample size to determine what they think a fair price should be for sale but as you can see in the last 12 months um 1895 um dollars was made and based off of what the it looks like the a lot of times they're setting it at a hundred dollars and the royalty paid off of that hundred dollars in the last 12 months would be eight 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 dollars and eighty one cents um in my previous videos i can go over how you can see what the yield was for um royalty music and stuff like that if you guys wanted to see it and if they had this particular one i might end up just doing it i probably won't do too many but the reason why i'm more so um just I'm also doing it to test it out and that's not necessarily for the actual return itself so it's more for educational purposes just in case if people was interested in it and they just wanted to see what would happen that's what I'm here for you know I'm testing out these um, investment platforms and things of that nature now let's go back to C1 fan investor benefits I don't necessarily really want to actually focus on that but let's see what else they have as far as see what else they have this one is the auction that they particularly have right now this one is live and this one is more so when they're trying to set the price that um that they think this should be per song share so um I, like I said, this one is just where they kind of try to set a price point and then from the live auction, it'll go to where you can actually um, buy it per share. But if you guys have any other questions, so far I think this platform is it's interesting. Um, music royalties for me and the expectations of the return and how you assess it to me is kind of completely new. So I'm kind of learning um, as I go. But I'll definitely, you know, keep you guys updated. It looks like they probably going to pay out quarterly. And, you know, I guess every time they pay out quarterly, um, I'll do an updated video if there's any substantial changes. You know, if I buy another song, I'll definitely update you. But that concludes this video. If you haven't already, make sure you hit the like button. If you're new, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Um, no.